Welcome back, everyone, to another episode of Baldur's Gate. I believe, yes, this is the Jintarim Guild that we've come to. I don't know what I'm doing here, but uh, I guess we can... Uh, I guess we can talk with them and see how things go. Oh, you rancid bastard. See? Mine's fresh. I see. Welcome to the guild hall. Why does he look like crap? Finest festival. As long as you're not he looks sober. like crap. Or able to smell. He just has a... He just has a different air style than I do. Well, let's... Victor isn't himself, so I'm running the shop. You buying or selling? Why both? Uh, and where do you get the items you sell? Maybe a bit of both. Show me what you got. Uh, dye, lush burgundy, shade slayer cloak. While hiding, the number you need to roll a critical hit while attacking is reduced by one. What if this affects if you have um, already a reduction, so that it becomes an 18? Oh, it, it can stack, okay. So that is nice to know. Uh, scroll of Haste is also nice. Oh yeah, let's sell these. And... Oh, these are scales? Okay, I thought I had some, um... Uh... I thought I... Oh, there we go. Silver band, empty string, gold necklace. Get rid of those. Okay. And you almost creep repels. Ooh. It's a little rabbit. The rabbit is called Snowball, and once he was lost, never to be found. I see. Uh we still have one of those, so it's fine. Sometimes stuff we sell comes back around to us again. So watch yourself. Got me? I see. See anything you like? Let's talk price. See anything of yours? No, you didn't. <laughs> no, you didn't. Uh, Guild Bursar guards. The Professor. Right. Which crew are you with? Bellbreakers, the children of Hall. The names ring familiar. Two of the many crews that make up the guild, a loose collective with ties to every criminal enterprise in the city's underworld. I see. Now they run a crew called the Worm Skulls. The Worm Skulls. Oh my God! Can't yes. Say I've heard of you. Spare me the story behind the name. I'm sure it's very scary. Fair warning. The Guildmaster wants no fraternizing with the Zentarim. They're here to work, not share war stories. They won't be much use to us if they're drinking and dicing when the Stone Lord kicks the door down. Stone Lord, does that? You're so sure the Stone Lord is going to attack? Well, whoever he is, he doesn't seem very keen on talking. He came out of nowhere and ate up half our turf in a ten day. So if you're speaking to the guild master, maybe step soft around the topic. Hmm? I see. Oh, it's probably, you know, the elder brain. Bear hands. Bear hands? 
don't mind the lady's court. Just a game we play. Figuring how we'll kill you if you cross nine fingers. I see. You did not see me. A peer of the Parliament openly walking the Guildhall would sell a few copies of Boulder's Mouth, I expect. Huh. No distractions, mate. Nine Fingers has me watching over Pierre Priss here. Wants our friends and Parliament close with this new Duke making moves. I see. Let's see. It's an orphanage, Ukta. What would you have me do? Seize their toys as payment? Well, they fail to pay tribute. We should withdraw our protection, at the very least. And cede more ground to the Stone Lord. <laughs> You're not suggesting I yield a single inch of the city, my city, to this cult. I... <clears throat> we already look weak. If you're seen to be forgiving debts... I didn't say forgive. Seize the building. Are many children old enough? If they protect what's mine, we'll consider that a start on what's owed. Yes, Guildmaster. I... Excuse me. <coughs> this is a private council. Keep your underpants clean, Ukta. We're playing host to a hero. You recall our reports of Kethrick Thorne, general of the absolute, champion of Merkel, unkillable tyrant of Moonrise. Meet the one who killed him. Unkillable. And your nine fingers king, guildmaster. A little less impressive as revelations go. You'll forgive the spying, I hope. The guild keeps watch for anyone of interest passing through our gates. I'd say you qualify. I already know the one thing about you that I need to. You've crossed paths with the cult's leadership before, and you're still standing. I mean to burn the Absolute from the face of my city. So if you mean to help, congratulations. We just became the best of friends. Great. Why do we need the guild? I've been doing well enough without you so far. What can I do to help you? I was you? planning to soften you up a bit first, but... Straight to business, then. You've been seen with a certain harper. Grey of hair, somewhat spiky of manner. Mm-hmm. You know what you hear? We're practically sisters. <laughs> so much so, I even stopped trying to have her killed a few years back. I need to speak with her. She's still getting the lay of the land, I expect. I have information that might help with that. So, remind her to pay an old friend a visit, would you? Okay. Yeah, I see why you two get along. Oh, I never said that we get along. Now, is there anything else you need? Uh... Information. Knowing what I know usually comes at a cost. But let's say we'll put it on your tab. Was it you know so much about the cult of the absolute and its leaders? Why is the Stone Lord who is the Stone Lord as your guild running it scared? How's your fight against the absolute going? I noticed the mercenaries in your hall. Since when does the guild work with this entire I'd like to know more about the guild. Okay, so is the Stone Lord? Leader of some new crew that's intent on painting my ass. If he was just another upstart who didn't like paying guild dues, fair enough. But he and his crew make no demands. Leave no survivors to pass on a message. All I know is that on every scrap of ground he takes from me, the cult of the Absolute soon starts sprouting. Doesn't matter. Whatever god the prick prays to, I'll send him to meet it soon enough. Okay. Simple enough. After Jahira warned me and then disappeared, I went nosing into the cult for myself. 
I could bore you with the details. How I found evidence of Gortush's projects, traced him to Orin the Red, and made a safe bet there was some dried out old necromancer to round out the three. Because it's always the dead, bloody three. <laughs> Has been half gods who can't help but make their irrelevance everyone else's problem. Uh... Oh. You've got some juicy little tidbit I haven't heard yet. Enslaved old brain, the astral prism, you. Huh. It seems like my intelligence on you was patchy at best. That's annoying. Annoying? That's it? So what do you plan to do now that you know? I had no intention of leaving my city in the Dead Three's hands. Definitely not leaving it to some slimy shit that doesn't even have hands. So, as long as you can keep a lid on what's growing inside you, we're allies. Until you can't, and we're not. Simple enough, I reckon. Now, war to be fought. You need anything? Where do we need to go? Uh, doing. Okay, so let's hmm. say this. You have, but don't be so quick to bat away a helping hand. We find few enough of them in this city. The flaming fist can be bought. The harpers are scattered, and the Parliament of Beers, well, they're just generally too inbred to be useful. <laughs> <laughs> the absolutes at our gate, and the guild are the only ones truly standing against it. Rinton rats. Mm. Did you enjoy the encounter? They got a payday out of me. I don't think they enjoyed it. <laughs> I have no doubt you gave them a good talking to. The rats usually keep a lid on their nastier notions, but with the Stone Lord business distracting me. Some are starting to test the leash. All the more reason to be rid of the cult quickly. So I can remind my crews it's not a leash round their necks if they cross me. It's a noose. I see. So we need Jahira on the group. Uh, for this conversation to go through. Let's go into camp. Let's leave Will. Baal's chosen has been bled. May her torment be tenfold of that which she inflicted. Ah, uh, could it be true. Mind flayers are like devils. They just sport tentacles rather than wings. Clever, manipulative, exploitative. The Emperor says he's a friend. I think we'd be fools to believe him. And maybe it's true. Maybe Stelmane allied with a mind flayer and subjected the city to their political will. Or maybe he made an offer she couldn't refuse. You know Stelmane? Huh? The first time I was a boy of seven or eight at a banquet in the Flaming Fist's honor. One look and I was smitten chestnut hair that flowed behind her like willow fronds as she floated from one room to the next as if carried by clouds the second time Stelmane was different even with the aid of a cane each step she took was a struggle every word she spoke took great physical effort a stroke victim I asked father later no he said a stroke survivor you sense uncertainty in Will's voice. He questions his father's explanation. It's partners with my flight emperor in the last. An idea could be behind the killing? Yes, there's more to this. Mm, something's always gnawed at me. At the banquet. Stelmay didn't seem to look at us, but through us. But that second time, her gaze never left me. It was steel, sharp and unyielding. It could just be my imagination, but I always felt that it was more than a stroke that had changed her. 
What, though? I couldn't say. Yeah, do you could be going to kill say, him? But think about this. I mean, we know already who it was. Tadpole. Stelmane is dead. The people are frightened and the council's in disarray. To exert control, he must first sow chaos. A tyrant strategy, as father would say. These murders aren't random acts. Someone powerful is guiding the killer's hand. And the city is made weaker for it. Okay, I like you should wait. The blade stands at the right and just Yeah. Uh Oh, we need to talk with her. Okay. It is not in a Githyanki's nature to say. Yeah, we did save her. <laughs> Our language doesn't even have a phrase for it. Kraith Khan Jan is the closest equivalent I know. May your enemies know agony. But after releasing me from Orin's grip, there is only one proper response. Thank you. Sincerely. You're welcome. <sighs> well, good then. Let's carry on. Okay. Jahira, it is. If you have business to conclude before we march, have it done. The road to Baldur's Gate is locked and the city needs us. We are in the city. With the Absolute's army gone, the Risen Road should be clear. We got there's a Harper's safe house in Worms Crossing. Dentalin's dent beyond that. The hilarious bit is that I've already done all of that. <laughs> uh she should probably have been with me. Oh, she is also a druid. Yeah, I forgot that. Um, gain the cantrip. Uh, poison spray. <sighs> Not to level her up till 11. Uh, gains all of these spells. Circle of the land. And two spells that are always prepared. Gain a whole person in Spike Grove, Coast, Mirror Image in Misty Step, Desert, Blur and Silence, Our Skin, whole person, Invisibility, Pass Without Trace. Pass Without Trace is good. Mirror Image, Spike Grove, Mulsacid Arrow and Rot Darkness, Underdark in Web and Misty Step. Um, Mulsacid Arrow. Gained a new cantrip. And the feet. Um, you know, maybe we increase wisdom. I don't think you learn a cantrip and number you need to roll a critical hit with spells reduced by one. This effect can stack. Okay, I can actually give that cloak to Will later. Uh, because of Eldritch Blast. Uh, mobile. Down when you dash. Off. Your point maximum increased by two for every level you have gained. Weapon Master. No. Warcaster. You get advantage saving throws to maintain concentration on a spell. Except that I'm going to have her... Yeah, I think I'm going with tough. Although, no. No, 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 no. We're going in. Going to increase that. Yeah, we're going to do that. 19 on wisdom. Okay, the passive. Circle of the land. All right, we gained another one. Sinking cloud, swamp, sinking cloud of period. Touch. Call lightning and flight. Let's go with that. Okay, 
Land stride, difficult terrain. You have become an expert in moving through the wilderness. Difficult terrain no longer slows you down. Nice. Wild shaped panther. Wild shaped owlbear. Okay, nice that they added. So I'm not mistaken, you're not supposed to be able to turn into an owlbear. With wild shape. Artek. Minor elemental and ice storm. Let's go with Arctic. I mean, let's see what Forest does. Computer Minor Elemental and Grasping Vine. Speed of Movement and Polymorph. Let's go with that. Uh, built Improvement again. Let's get her to 20 and let's start working on her constitution. Gain the passive, circle of the land. Contagion. Wall of stone, conjure elemental. Insect plague, cloud kill. Insect plague, forest, mass cure wounds, and contagion, desert, wall of stone, insect plague. Cultural mental and greater restoration. Um, let's go with that. So we do have the restoration spell available at least. Or at least an additional one. Nature's ward, you can't be charmed or frightened by elementals and fang. Disease and poison also no longer affect you. Nice. Well shaped. Dilophosaurus. Ooh. I like that. Resistance cantrip. Druid level 11. What we get? Uh, level 6 spell slot and level 6 spells. Okay. And let's move out. and talk with her. You owe me a gold piece, Grandmother. When I heard you died out in the wilderness, I made an offering at Kalimvor's well. Of gold? Oh, I did not know I meant so much to you, Guildmaster. No but she's her grandmother? Mental. Case in point, I've just let a harper walk through my guild hall, noticeably unholed. Because I'm curious about why you're here and who it is you've brought with you. Well, you already know I'm a friend of Jeeves. How nice. You won't find many of those in my guild hall. We won't tax your hospitality too long, Nine Fingers. I'm searching for Minsk of Rashomon. A big name, that. Such information does not come cheap, High Harper. Not in normal times. Of course. Seeing as these are not normal times and we're all such good friends, I'll do better than tell you where he is. I'm bringing him here as we speak. Or parts of him, at least. I gave no orders about the condition of his goals. Treachery is this, Nine Fingers. Have you thrown in with the Absolute too? Against my own city. Careful. You're in very real danger of hurting my feelings. It's Minsk who's found his faith with Faerun's newest god. And a new name with it. Stonelord. Lies. It means something. What makes you think he's joined the Absolute? Maybe he just doesn't like thieves? Accenture, we know the cult can be persuasive. Aye, I considered that. But there's a pattern to his strikes and intent. In his short reign, the Stone Lord and his crew have earned a reputation. Pure brutality. No survivors. 
and where he mows my people down, this ripe little cult takes root. But not for much longer. We have word on where he plans to hit next. And he'll find us ready to hit back this time. Nine fingers. Estelle, call off your ambush. Tell us where he is, and we'll handle this. We? I see no harp as Jahira. I'm sorry, but this fight's too big for you alone. She's not alone, she has me. If you're half the friend you're posing as, you'll tell her that her part in this is done. The Stone Lord's fate is sealed. We have a bigger war to fight. I'd rather turn our talk to that, but if you need a moment, Jahira, well, you've earned that much. My guild hall is open to you. Have a drink, Jahira. Have a rest. Just leave well enough alone. It would be a shame for the city to lose two of its heroes in one day. So... I would be lying if I told you I was certain we would walk out of that temple a lot. We faced Baal there once, and now it is Gortash's turn. We'll need his stone to finish this. However you plan to acquire it. So let us go pay Lord At the Harper's safe house. Dentalans have overtaken us. My contact there just sent word. The Harpers have been fractured. Infiltrated by doppelgangers. Perhaps we might have done something to help. I have not been overly generous with the truth. I came here to learn of the Chosen. True enough. But I set my heart for searching for someone else, too. Tell me. What do you know of a man named... Mince oh, and now she's Russian? actually telling me this. <gasps> oh, my God. Of course Minsk. she's a... Huh? The name is as she's a total fangirl. A, a hero of the time of troubles. Who saved the city more than once? Travel with you back in in, back, uh, in the old days, Baldurin. There isn't Baldurin alive who doesn't know that name. But few know of his fate, I think. I had hoped to keep it that way. Minsk is an old friend. Perhaps my oldest. We fought at one another's backs times beyond counting. And the last time I saw him, I left him to die. What happened? I suspect there is more to the story than that. I'm not sure what this has to do with our fight against Cole. There always is. But that is still the fundamental fact of it. Before we ever heard of this absolute, we received word of a gathering in the Undercity. What we found was the first dark seed of this plot. A circle of cultists with mind flares in their midst. We might have ended it there. Cut off at the root, but before I could send for help, Mint charged in alone. It was chaos. He oh, okay, was so he's Dragged been taken over. Beneath a mass of tentacles. I had a choice. Stay and let word of this cult die with us, or leave him and live to fight another day. Here you are. You made the right choice. Don't second guess yourself. The world takes much from those who presume to defend it, but sometimes you get to take it back. So don't be sorry, because I mean to use you, if you're willing. Infection, indoctrination, eradication—that has been the fate of everyone the cult has captured so far. But it has not been yours. With your help. Perhaps it need not be Minsk's either. Well, let's find him. As simply as that? <clears throat> Perhaps you two will get along. Oh, the point is moot without the means to find him. Without the Harpers, we shall have to find another path. I'll have a better idea of what that is once we're through the gates. Seems I need to reacquaint myself with this damned city. We we are through the gates. There's little point in pressing nine fingers further. Okay. She swore no vows. She won't tell us where to find Minsk. Someone else in her guild hall will. We need to be swift. 
Okay, where do you suggest we begin? I suppose we must greet the local wildlife. Guildhall is awash with ale scented gossip at the best of times. These days, they have nothing but the Stone Lord to talk about. Yeah, true, true. We're traveling together. I realize I don't know much about you. Okay, leave. Um, Lady Lockjaw. Oh, there's some other people here. Corridor. Careful around the steel watch. The old guard gave thieves a slap on the wrist, but those bolted bastards whew, will rip off the whole damn arm. Yeah, I kind of want to get rid of them. Uh... What's the point in paying the guild for protection when they've pulled back all their crews? There's a bloody army coming. Not anymore. This guy just drink drinks, I guess. But he has no icon. It's Uktar you want. Old Silver Smile there. You are not known to me. For supplies, seek the bugbear. To trade trinkets, the fetchers brats. I am Uktar, duly elected guild bursa. And I will not have my time wasted. Oh, is that what Nine Fingers was doing earlier? Wasting guild time with this Stone Lord business? Hmm. You might say so. But I could not possibly comment. <laughs> I sense there is no love lost between the two of you. I need not love to serve. You have a point you wish to make? The quicker I deal with the Stone Lord, the quicker Nine Fingers gets back to business. Hmm. I have not come so far by indulging in petty disputes. But I am open to transactions of mutual benefit. I am interested in gaining access to vaults beneath the counting house. I'd oh, well I have the key. The key. I have one of the keys. Provided said vaults are a not emptied prematurely of course <laughs> i suspect that what you seek might also be found beneath the counting house i tell you this only as a matter of mutual interest she plans to ambush minsk at the counting house but what the hell would he want there what you do with that information is a matter for yourself now back to the vault keys do we have business to conduct? Do we? Uh, ooh, do we want to give him the Casador's key? You cheat, push. You cheat, push. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm not selling that. I, I think I want to, to check with Casador. I have no keys to sell right now. Until you do. Uh. Snap bone. Wait, where is the bugbear that he's he mentioned? But he's at least told us, you know, where it is gonna be. Bat twin bubbins, three piece. There is the one piece, where is the two piece? Because we have found the three piece. That is a really bad joke, I know. Um, hmm. Still don't see the bugbear around. Oh, never mind. This is actually much bigger. Oh, it is on. The city sewers. Find Misk at the counting house. Where exactly is the counting house? Can I move the map to uh, other areas? Been there? Uh, no, no, no. Let's just go out. 
We we need to take Jahira with us on this. Um. Oh. It's all the way down there. Okay. Then let's go through there. And we'll probably finish this by the time we get there. Because it's already been like half an hour. As I did say before, I am trying to keep these to be a bit lesser in the uh, amount of time they take, but some of them do go on for like an hour, so oh, 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 well, am I not allowed to go through here? Yeah, I should be. you love these back streets and little alleyways that they made? Oh. Is there another way in? Let's at least try. Okay, let's stop it here. So if you've been enjoying Crap's Little Adventure with his group of friends, then do leave a like, drop a comment down below, and subscribe to the channel if you haven't. I'll see you in the next one.